Tom, welcome and congratulations on becoming the new chairman of Nottingham Forest. How does it feel? Fantastic. Thank you very much for that. Uh, massive grin on my face and uh, truly an honour and a privilege to take this responsibility. So, very exciting. And would you like to explain your connection with the club and your relationship with it a bit further? Yeah, absolutely. Well, my first game actually was 40 years ago when my father snuck me under his uh, coat and I went up to the top of the executive stand behind me and since then I don't think I've really left in, in terms of mentally. I've been here now for over 40 years. Uh, and on a match day, I've got my father, my mum, my, sis uh, my sister, my wife, my kids, my uncle, my auntie at the ground. So for Forrest, it is an enormous part of our life, but also something that is not just uh, keeps us busy on Saturday, but it keeps us entertained the whole week, you know, progressing and thinking about where the club could go. And how do you assess where the club is at in its current stage? Oh, the ownership in the last five or six years have done a phenomenal job taking what was an average performing team and club into the next space as, as a Premier League side and we've now got to consolidate that and kick on again and I think we're in really good shape both on and off the pitch but like ever any business continues to evolve and we've got a lot of hard work ahead of us to uh, become an excellent Premier League team not just a Premier League team. And what do you hope to achieve in your chairmanship here at Nottingham Forest? I think people will make the obvious link of my, my uh, career in, in real estate and in design and one of the opportunities is to really focus on the infrastructure uh, the ownership is acutely aware that the facilities we've got is probably not the standard that we're seeing in other Premier League grounds around the country. So your first objective is to look at the facilities both here and at the training ground and, and make sure they're as best as they possibly can do. And then my, my career, my history is, is, is very much on the commercial side as well. So exposing the club where I can to new connections around the world, different parts of the world are fascinated with the Premier League. Uh, and that's an opportunity for me as well to, to really reinforce that. And obviously the last thing is, is clearly as a Nottingham person, I want to make sure that the fans are listening and hearing and getting the right honest messages from the leadership of the club. And that's something I'm really focused on as well. And what would your message be to your fellow Forest fans as you begin this exciting new chapter? That I, I, This is a place I care about massively and I, I hugely trusted with their loyalty that they give every week coming to watch the game. So best interests at heart, but also as a club, we've got to continue to progress and be more, you know, better expectations of what we should be achieving. I think this club has, that, you know, settled for, dare I say, average over many, many years. And one of the first things the owner said to me when I first met him was, "Why is it that the fans of this club ha can accept defeats and draws? Where is the the expression of excellence that we want to try and achieve?" So, I'm here to deliver that message that we are focused on making sure Nottingham Forest in the Premier League is a truly exceptional club and that's something I can't wait to get started with. Tom, thank you and welcome to Nottingham Forest. Thank you very much.